this tutorial will focus purely on percentage increase. This scenario is based upon say, a theme park or a football team that has sold a specific number of tickets in the year 2015. And they're estimating in their business plan that they'll sell 10% more tickets next year. So in your head you can think, okay, we want to sell 10% more. or work out what 10% is. Now, there's a very specific way you can do that in spreadsheets. The way you have to do it at national uh, 4, 5 and higher to show your formula is as follows. You've got your equal symbol. As always, because if you don't use equals, your formula won't work. You have the number or the sale that you want to find 10% of. And we want to find 10% of B4. And then we want to add onto this. We want to increase this number by 10%. So it's a plus symbol. There are brackets. And this is where it might get a little bit confusing. We want to find 10% of B4. So we we'll do B4 multiplied by 10%. Now, if you remember maths, particularly if you remember bod mass, you do your brackets first. So first of all, we want to find 10% of B4. And increase that, add that on to the B4 we already have. So we're increasing 42%. So we're increasing 42,000 by 10%, like so. And then, because we have an absolute cell reference, we can just copy that one down. And the B4 will become B5, the B6, the B7, and so on and so on. And potentially, another way you can do this would be if you had a floating variable like we have here with our 10%. If we wanted to estimate, maybe quite over the top, that we wanted to increase our ticket prices by 10% each year. You would follow more or less the same path. You need your equal symbol. Then the item that you want to increase by 10%, as always a plus symbol, or brackets. Again, the item you want to increase by 10%, your multiply symbol, and your percentage. The percentage you want to increase by. You would close your bracket. Now, if you remember, because we have a floating variable, we have to make this absolute, make an absolute cell reference. And that is simply with your dollar sign, the F4 button on your keyboard. Again, push enter and copy it down. So as you can see, formula to increase something by 10% may, may sound complex when you start to think about it. However, generally it is you know quite straightforward you've got the item that you want to increase by the plus symbol so there we go formula just popped up there we have the cell reference of what we want to increase your plus symbol because it's a percentage increase the cell reference of your item and your multiply symbol either with a cell reference or with an actual percentage. So remember, percentage increase.